Hey guys, what's going on? It's Josh. I am the Thrifty Dad and I wanted to come at you this morning because I just finished doing some yard sailing. I love going out on Friday mornings for yard sales. There's lots of treasures that can be found. So today, you know, I kind of wanted to show you these things that I picked up, but I also want to tell you that, you know, the day started off really slow. Okay, I drove around for probably two hours, hit up some yard sales, did not find a single thing that was worth buying. Um, I was kind of disappointed. I was starting to make my way home like, okay, I guess today, you know, is one of those bad days. Uh, about a mile away from my house, I found one more yard sale, jumped in there, started looking around, In the back was a rack, and it had men's dress shirts, okay? So I saw those glowing, you know, angels coming down, oh, dress shirts hanging out all by themselves. Walk over there, there were nine dress shirts that I had my eyes on, okay? They had $3 tags on them. Um, let me go ahead and show you what I picked up, and then I'll tell you how much I paid. So I got a Paul Frederick, always a good dress shirt to pick up, okay? If you ever see Paul Frederick, you're going to make a few bucks on it. As long as you get a front or five dollars, you're going to be perfectly fine. I found three Brooks Brothers, another great brand. If you've been watching videos on YouTube, and if you've been watching eBay and selling dress shirts, you know Brooks Brothers is always going to be a good brand to snag. Love this red color. That red plaid is going to look really good. And also got a uh, short sleeve Brooks Brothers. So that might do well too. I haven't sold a short sleeve one before. So we'll see how that goes. And then I also have five Ralph Lauren. A couple of them are Ralph Lauren Polo. But here, let me show you one at a time here. Got a little yellow plaid, you know. Not the most appealing color, but this one still might do all right. And then the rest of them, I think, are all blue. So this guy must have been really into blue. We get the blue stripe. Here's a darker blue stripe. I like this one because of the uh, the logo. It's actually like real color logo. Solid blue. The solid blue looks really good. And lastly, another blue stripe. I mean, really, all these shirts are nice and crisp. I picked up nine dress shirts, okay? They had $3 tags on them. I offered them $10 for all nine. And you know what? They accepted it. I couldn't believe it. I made sure I had a $10 bill because that would have looked pretty bad if I would offer 10 and only gave or ended up giving them a $20 bill and asking for change. So, you know, nine shirts, $3 a piece. I was looking at $27 if I would have paid what they were asking. Instead, I got it for $10. So, almost a, exactly a dollar a piece, guys. I'm going to make a pretty good profit off of these. So, I mean, each one should sell for $10, $15, $20 bucks a piece plus shipping uh, at only a dollar a piece. That's a good day. So, you know, you're going to have these bad days or slow days, things that you don't, days that you don't find anything worth selling. And that's okay. It happens, all right? It makes you a little uh, quicker at being able to identify things and you know it just helps you learn too because you you're just not gonna have a good day every day all right I got lucky on this last stop can't beat it so you know make sure you uh, subscribe to my channel please like the video uh, always helps me uh, know what you're liking comment below if you had any good finds this weekend at your yard sales uh, look forward to hearing from you all right thanks for watching